Hey guys, I'm Thiago Kifuri from Fiotech and I'm here with my new product car. It's a 1983 Rabbit GTI. This one is equipped with a 16 valve engine with two Weber 45 carburetors. And today I'm gonna install it a very, very helpful equipment, especially for that kind of cars that we don't have any information. But today I'm gonna install the O2 sensor. This one goes in the exhaust and the reader. Basically, with this equipment installed in the car, I can have the air fuel radio. So this will be very, very helpful in a tuning process of this car. And so let's start the installation. So here is the harness that I'm gonna use it to install it. It's two wires with negatives, one switched it, 12 volts. And if you are running a power FT like IFT 450, 550, 600, you have a CAN connector here. And if you are running the other ECUs from FuelTech, you have another cable here that you can use. And also the Nano comes with installation guide. So basically here you have the, the whole information about the product. In my case, my car at this moment is fully carbureted. I'm gonna use it three wires. Here in my engine, I already have the place to install the O2 sensor if you don't have it. So basically I removed the, the cover on the exhaust and now I'm gonna install the O2 sensor. Let me show you guys where the O2 sensor goes. As you can see, here it is installed. Let me find the harness. So here it is. Then I have to figure out where the, I wanna go with the harness. I think it can go this way. So here I will connect. There we go. So here I have the harness inside the car. The cover of my cluster just to create some room here to go with the harness and now I'm gonna connect the nano it's a connector behind the reader so there we go and so here I have the position where I'm gonna install it the reader so left side of my dash it will be nice here so I found a, a positive here on the engine bay so this is a switch it so basically it's already connected now and the two wires from negatives must be connected to the battery you have the two wires and i'm gonna install it here in this part of the battery and so guys i just installed the nano here in the left side of the dashboard when i turn on the car there's a heating process of the o2 sensor so here we can see the air fuel radio. Uh, the car is a little bit rich for idle speed. When I go like 1500 RPM, start oh, so lean. Well, now my tuning process of the car will be way faster with this information because now I know what is the air fuel radio that I have in the car. Okay, see you guys here in the Fuel Tech channel. Bye.